Hello and welcome to the Excellent English Club. Today's topic is What are the aspirated and unaspirated sounds? Let's start. Aspirated and unaspirated sounds. This is very common. Sometimes you hear English people speak these three letters in a different way. I will let you know today how you can pronounce these three letters in different places. These are the three consonants I have taken from those 24 consonants. These are plosive sounds, pa, ta, ka. These are voiceless sounds. And how we pronounce these three sounds? Look here. Pa as in Spain, pa as in space, pa as in ispel. Pa, pa, pa. Now in the second group, pa as in pain, pa as in pace, and pa as in pill. Look, why I am pronouncing like this? Here I am saying pa, pa, pa. And in the right side, I am saying pa, 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 not pa, pa, pa. Why I am pronouncing like this, I will let you know. Just concentrate on these examples. Number two, ta sound. Is to stop strain. Is to stop strain. On the right side, till top train. Till top train with H. Extra power, extra air coming from the mouth. Till top train. Third example, ka. Skill, scare, scope. Skill, scare, scope. The right side, another example. Kill, care, coop. The pronunciation is different. This side, we are producing pa, ta, and ka. And this side, we are pronouncing pa, ta, ka. Why? Look. When pa, ta, ka. I have written C, Q also in, in under bracket. C, Q is also produced ka sound. So, there are three letters which produce ka sound. K, Q, and C. Or you can say C, K, or Q. These three letters produce ka sound. That's why I have written this C, Q also in the bracket that these also produce ka sound. So when pa, ta, ka, or C, Q come at the beginning of a word, at the starting, as you will see here, as in pa, pa pain, till, ta, kill, ka. So these three letters, they are coming at the beginning. They are coming at the beginning. The word is starting with these words. If pa, ta, ka come at the beginning of a word, they become pa, ta, ka, means aspirated. If you give extra force, extra air to produce pa, ta, ka, that is aspirated sound. If you don't give extra air to produce this sound, it means these are not aspirated, these are unaspirated sound. Look at the example. This is the table. Look here. The first sound is pa. In paper, place, place, play, plant. Everywhere I am saying pa, 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 not pa, pa, pa. Why? Because the pa sound is coming at the beginning. I have put in red color here. So you can easily understand that the pa is coming at the beginning. And this orange color, this is the pronunciation of these words. Paper, please, place, play, plant. The second sound is ta. In ta, you will see that truck, tree, traffic, time, table. Again, you can see that there is a blue color and ta everywhere is coming at the beginning. Third example is ka, as in key, cool, clock, K, 
केक किटिन एंड इन ऑरेंज कलर दीज आर द साउंड्स और यू कैन सी द प्रोनाउंसिएशन ऑफ दीज वर्ड्स आई हैव रिटन ओके नाउ मूव टू द एग्जांपल ऑफ अन एस्प्रेटेड साउंड दीज आर एस्प्रेटेड विद एच विद एक्स्ट्रा पावर एक्स्ट्रा फोर्स ऑफ एयर दे आर कॉल्ड एस्प्रेटेड साउंड्स नाउ मूव टू अन एस्प्रेटेड साउंड विदाउट एक्स्ट्रा फोर्स एक्स्ट्रा पॉफ लुक वेन पाटा का और सी क्यू कम इमिडिएटली आफ्टर द फर्स्ट लेटर और इन द मिडिल और एट द एंड डजेंट मैटर बट नॉट एट द बिगिनिंग दे बिकम पार्ट आ का अन एस्पिरेटेड हाउ लुक एर एट दम लुक एट दिस टेबल फर्स्ट वन इज पा एज इन स्पेस स्प्रिंग सेकेंड वन टा एज इन स्टोम नॉट स्टोम स्टोम start is start ta sound is in two places and both the places are coming after the first letter of a sound so we will say ta ta no ta ta so it will be start the third example is ka as in scooter or skirt if pa ta ka come after the first letter or sound they will be pronounced pa ta ka which are called unaspirated sounds if like this they come at the beginning or the word starts with pa ta ka or c q means ka sound it will be pronounced pa ta ka means aspirated sound do you understand so today i told you that how to pronounce pa ta ka if these three letters come at the beginning of a word or how you will pronounce these three letters if they come after the first letters that's all you usually understand what is aspirated what is unaspirated and what are the 44 sound if you have any query any question you can ask me in the comment column thank you very much see you in the next video bye bye